Okay, we're gonna hang in there for just a minute. I'm on early. If you have any questions, you can shoot them out. Um, we're gonna talk about six. Started with four, I added five, I got six. Six amazing, simple, powerful exercises you have to do if you are sitting behind a computer. And um, if you're not doing them, this could ruin, absolutely ruin your health. Let's see if I can get this little better lighting. So in today's, Jennifer, I knew you were going to be on. You always watch. Awesome. This is for you. I think I've told you some of these, but these are some really simple, powerful exercises. If you are sitting, watch my posture. Normal, upright posture. Watch what happens. Look at this. This is nursing home posture. This is horrible. Good upright posture, you can't help but fall into bad posture when you're on a computer. Even if it's at a desk, you find yourself hunching, rolling forward. As you roll forward, your shoulders roll forward, your chest tightens up, you contract your chest, you contract the rib cage, you can't, you can't take a deep breath, you're losing oxygen. If you lose oxygen, you're losing health, you're losing vitality, you're losing blood flow into muscles and organs, and you're dying. And they say, now the, the computer error, the texting, the computers, is going to be more deadly than smoking, the, 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 the dangers. Why? Because we're stagnant. It's like a stagnant pond. There's nothing coming in and nothing going out. It's just bleh, disgusting. It's going to die. You don't want to let this happen to you. So we're going to talk about six things. So here we go. You're sitting at your desk. You have to set a timer or something that slaps you in the back of the head that says, wake up, change, do, move, get up. This takes anywhere from a minute to just a few minutes. If you don't do it, it will be destructive on your muscles, your joints, your spine, You'll get decay, degenerative disc disease in your spine, degenerative arthritis in your spine. It will ruin you. Hey, Kim. So, um, I actually have it facing this way so I can see names, even without my glasses. It's getting better. <laughs> and so you have to do these things. This isn't a, well, I'll get around to it. It's like if you don't brush your teeth. Disgusting. You have to do this. So, number one, this is a real simple one. You're sitting at your desk and you just... You sit upright, you pull your shoulders, so your shoulder blades, your shoulder blades squeeze together. You want to squeeze your shoulders together and pretend like you're doing a jumping jack. Now you can do a jumping jack, and it's even better if you do that because you're getting your legs involved, you're, you're getting your arms, but here's what's key. Key, don't miss this, is you, you, wanna, you don't want to have your arms just flailing up and down. You want to contract your shoulder blades tight. Ugh. And you can do this seated. I want you all, if you're sitting there, you're obviously you're watching me, try this. Sit, sit up nice and tall, chest out, shoulders back, bring your arms up and squeeze your shoulder blades. And now do 10 of these. Keep your arms back as far as you can, shoulder blades contracted. As you do this, I don't know how many that is, about seven. What happens is, as soon as you're done, you can't help but sit upright. Give me a thumbs up if that worked. <laughs> I don't know if anyone's listening or, or paying attention. <laughs> it's like a teacher in class. Um, so immediately, you'll, you'll feel yourself upright. If you can, get out of your seat and excellent. There we go. <laughs> you do some jumping jacks. Just do 10 of them. What you do is, as soon as you do that, you reboot your, your electrical system, your computer system. You reboot your brain. It's like a slap to the head. It like shocks you. So if you don't shock your system, you, you end the day stagnant. Your energy will be very low. Your muscles will be very tight. So you will have no flexibility. And you'll feel groggy and feel bleh. And then you think, well, I'm going to go home and have a drink, have a glass of wine or a beer to unwind. Wrong. So now we have to go home and add chemicals and toxins into our body? Okay, here's another exercise. 
You can do this with a band. We have these bands in our office. They're very high duty, high strong. They'll last for years. So you can do a couple things with a band. And many of you have this. Is you can put it underneath your knee and it's like a row. All you're doing is pulling and contracting. You see, I'm not going far. This could be, I, my knee could be under the desk, and you wouldn't even know what I'm doing if you're at work. If many of you are at work, if you're at home, because many of you are working longer hours at home, and you're getting up early, working on your computer, you're working later on your computer, because you, you have more time, you can't go anywhere. You do five or ten of these, and immediately, as soon as you do, chest comes out, shoulders go up, posture. Another thing you can do with a band, you can buy these tubes just about anywhere, put it behind your neck, and you want to pump your neck, push your neck back against the band. What that does is it reestablishes the curve or the spring, the arc in your neck. As you sit like this, you take the arc out, horrible for your spinal cord. Degenerative changes that occur, demyelination occurs on the spinal cord itself. It degenerates, bad stuff. So as you implement the curve immediately, you're like, wow, feel more range of motion. Okay, another one, really important, is a squat and a lunge. So you, as you sit, what happens is your knees and your hips get stuck. You need to bend them. People come into my office, oh, my back hurts. I've been sitting too long. Well, don't sit. Get out and squat. Now, what you want to do is when you squat, you want to have your feet, you can't see my feet at this point, feet flat on the ground. Don't, have, don't go up on your toes. Have your feet flat on the ground. Squat all the way to the ground. And you can hold this. Try this if you're, you're at home. Hold this, feet flat. If you can't get your feet flat, you just keep working until your feet can get flat. Let me show you up on the, like this. But as far down as you can, feet flat. So if your feet can get flat, you have good flexibility in your hips, knees, hips, knees, ankles, and strong back. If you're like this, you don't have that flexibility yet. You can hold this for 10 seconds, 20 seconds, or you can do reps. Just do five, two, three, four, five. As soon as you do five, go back, start working. What this also does is it re-energizes re your brain. When I was in chiropractic school, when I was studying for my, my exams, my finals, and my state boards, I would study for seven to ten days straight. I would just be at my desk and just study and be in a library and study groups, praying that I pass these tests that were very hard. So I would find myself staring at something and reading something, phagocytosis, phagocytosis. And then I'm like, I don't even want to read anymore. <laughs> my mind is just dead. So immediately, when I found myself in this, in this pattern, I would get up, put on my running shoes, go for a run. 10, 20, 30 minute run, come back, get some water, sit back down, I'm refreshed. But you can do this as simple with a, with a couple squats, or a band, or a jumping jack without jumping, a seated jack, um, or by, by re re-stimulating your nerve system. Another thing you must have during the day is water. If you don't have water, what happens to, to anything that doesn't have water? It dries up. You have to keep drinking. You're not going to be able to drink this all and absorb its absorption over time. Think of when it rains heavy, the water hits the ground, it just runs off. But if it rains real slow and gentle all day, it gets absorbed deep into the ground. We want a slow rain, not a hard downpour for an hour. It won't get absorbed into the ground. So if you just pound one glass, half of it, you'll just pee out. But if you sip on this all day and you just keep getting sips, your body starts absorbing it. Your organs, your, your joints, 
gets into your muscles. So by the end of the day, you feel good. Here's another one. This is something that if you're not afraid of getting dirty, you can go on the ground, bring a mat. Or if you're at home, you can do this on your, on your floor, on your carpet. doesn't matter. I mean, you can get up and wash your hands. At this point, you should all know how to wash your hands. So you could, you could get in a push-up position and just arc. Just hold this as an arc position. Head up. Oh. Stretch out. Oh. So there's a couple stretches. But then you can stay in this position and do just do five push-ups. As soon as you do that, what, what happens is your chest muscles, your pecs, will start to contract in and they'll get tight like this. You ever see people walk around, their shoulders are rolled. So when you do it, you're pushing, stretching, taking that tension and opening it up so blood flow can get in, energy can get in. So at the end of the day, the goal is at the end of the day, you, you're revitalized. In the end of your career, you're revitalized. You're not crippled with chronic pain and problems. Um, another thing you can do, and I don't have a doorway, but get in a doorway, put your hand on each side of the door, and just lean forward and let your chest stretch. Oh, it will feel so good. Because you'll take that tension and open it up. Ah, and just as you lean 45 degrees into it, just lean your body and let it stretch. You could do all these in, in a minute. You could do a couple push-ups, a couple squats, lean into the door. If you have a band, do a band. Do five of those. If not, just do five or ten seated jacks or jumping jacks. And then go right back to work. The, the, the information I hear from patients all the time, oh, I'm so tight. And I ask, what are you doing? Uh, I didn't do anything today. Did you drink any water? No, I forgot. I, I can't help you with that. I can adjust you, and it, it will release some tension, but you have to be actively involved. Because over a lifetime, if you do this, you'll still degenerate. If you're getting care, you'll degenerate slower. But if you're not, you'll degenerate quite rapidly, and then you'll be crippled with pain and problems. So... Um, uh, nah, 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 nah. and that was it it's just those, it's real simple let's review them real quick one, if you have a band behind your neck pump, one two, three, four, five it works the neck and it works the arms put that behind your knee do a row contract and hold hold jumping jacks Elbows as far back as you can. Squeeze. Do this five or ten times. It resets your posture. Stretch. Stretch. Push up. Push up. In between the doorway, stretch. Squat. Feet flat. Squat. Hold. Or do reps, and one last one is a lunge. You step forward, feet are flat. You squat down, so your knee can touch the ground. I'll do it up here. This is a little shaky, so if I fall, I'll get right back up. I've had worse. Like that. You can do five of those. Five of those. So you only need a couple to five to maybe ten to break the pattern. It only takes a minute or two, and you can hear, I do this, I'm starting to breathe a little heavier, I re-energize myself, I feel better. I hope that helps. That's a quick one. Um, it's something you must do. Please share these with people. Anyone who's at work today, unless they're laborers, most of us are on a computer at, part, at some part of the day, Many, 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 many are sitting there all day on a computer, devastating to our health. And then we try to make it up with a 20-minute run or yoga class at the end of the day. You're not going to change with that. You have to be, uh, you have to have many facets to this. You have to exercise. You have to drink your water, get adjusted, 
do spinal exercises, keep your posture, and you have to do it throughout the day so you're breaking that pattern. Otherwise, you'll just keep getting tighter and tighter. Hope that helps. Please respond. If you have any questions, just send me a, a, a question or a response. If this was something you liked, just let, let us know because we're trying to do this to help benefit you and come up with topics that you're interested in. So if there's something you're really interested in, just send us a note and um, we'll get it uploaded and we'll, we'll enter it in. We're trying to do these every week. Tuesday at 1 o'clock, Thursday at 7. And please share these. Look forward, go on our Innate Life page, like us, and get the go to the video section where you get recommendate or um, I'm not sure you, you something <laughs> I forget. You get logged in and then you know you, you get our um, our notices. So when we shoot a video or do anything, notifications. Uh, God bless. Have an amazing day. Thanks all of you for watching. It's fun to do these. And uh, it's fun to hear your results. Great. Have a great day. See ya.